Mouth Maniacs. I'm in Phoenixville, PA at Tony's Family Restaurant, about to take on their in-restaurant giant Intimidator Burger Challenge. I grew up in the area, but never knew about this until recently. So I'm gonna get in there and show you guys what we're gonna be doing today. Let's see what Tony's got to offer me. All right guys, the Tony's Intimidator Challenge just came out. Five double burgers, I think a pound of gravy fries and coleslaw. It's about seven and a half pound challenge. We'll see what I can do. I'll be right back after this cools down. We're gonna get started here in just a second. I'll probably get full before an hour, so if I don't finish it within like 35 minutes, I might be out of luck. I'm gonna get my timer set up and then we can start here. These are fresh. One hour in three, two, one, go. What is up Mouth Maniacs? I'm excited to be bringing you another in-restaurant food challenge in this week's video. Let me just apologize for that footage that was showed a little bit of the darker side of competitive eating. Sometimes things like that happen, but I wanted to include that in the video just to show that it does happen and I'm not just hiding that from you guys. I'm a little bit more calm at this point. Got through that little choking scare. I'm ready to continue on and take on this Tony's Intimidator Challenge. Now this challenge is based close to my hometown of Phoenixville, Pennsylvania and consists of five double-double burgers, a pound and a half of gravy fries, and a big pint of coleslaw. As you can see, I just finished up my third of these big burgers. and I'm much calmer now. So this is not an advertised challenge at Tony's, so you have to kind of know about the challenge to be able to do it. You have to set it up in advance. And they also offer another Annihilator challenge. Now I learned in talking with the current owner that this place is an institution. It's been around for a long time, past hands and owners a couple times, and used to have a drive-in feature in the back which is no longer open, but they still are open for dining inside the restaurant, which they've added an ice cream shop to. I would highly recommend checking out Tony's, either for some good old fashioned restaurant grill style cooking. The grill is right where you're eating so you can see exactly what's being made for you. Or if you wanna try your hand at one of these challenges, either the Intimidator Burger Challenge or the Annihilator Sandwich Challenge, Give them a call a few days in advance and see if they can set it up for you. One of the last things I'll say about this challenge is that they advertise it as seven and a half pounds of food. And I found that to be pretty accurate. A lot of times restaurants will overestimate how much food by weight or by amount is in their challenges. But I found this to be about seven and a half pounds if I had to guess as well. The burgers were very big. I'm gonna continue on with these fries and let you guys watch me finish up the challenge here. Follow me on Instagram and subscribe if you haven't already.
little over 20 minutes in, guys. Alright guys, I, I just wrapped up. The t-shirt. Alright guys. You're beating the challenge. Check it out. Alright, congratulations, nice job. Tony's in Phoenixville, Pennsylvania. Alright. Awesome guys, about 25-ish minutes or so, so. Wow, 25 minutes? How do you feel? You feel good? I, I feel a little bit better than I did 10 minutes ago, believe it or not. Awesome. I, I was worried. Is this good or you want me to get this? Get the scraps. It's not done yet. There's nothing on that plate. I got I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs>